So guys, our first international triathlon race of the year. It's an indoor triathlon. If you guys can go ahead and subscribe and like, that would be epic. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy this travel of ours to Rotterdam and the Super League Arena Games, which was extremely tough. And I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> Oh, so we found the magic at the end of the tunnel. <laughs> Thank you, I'll have some Red Bull. Yeah, so that was the last bit of run prep before Super League Triathlon. I don't know if I'm going to make a video out of this film, but... Not yet. Filmed it anyway. <laughs> Never jumped onto our bicycle before. Uh, stationary. Normally we jump on our bikes while we're running. So we've got to make sure that we practice these transitions to get them perfectly right. Uh, hopefully it saves us some time uh, when we're doing transition on uh, the race this weekend. Cut, let's just do this. Done, off the bike. Okay, so now I've set my shoes up now with these elastic laces. Tighten them on. I, I think you're going to put it yet yeah, further down. Yeah, there we go. Feels weird to have price shoes on again. Maybe I'll start with the first one. I need to cut something with my issue. <laughs> my shoes got stuck. So it's uh, Saturday morning and heading for an easy spin just to loosen the legs up a bit and then we've got to pack the car and we're going off to Rotterdam. The testing these shoes of mine like this. Looks a bit weird. I look like a school kid. Same. You're going to try the same? Winter is coming! Pack the car. A little foot. My soul's gonna. Little butt. Teamwork makes the dreams work. So we had to take the camera off because we're not allowed to film on the roads in the Netherlands, but... So we're en route to Rotterdam Arena Games. We've got Marcel with us, Rachel's in the back somewhere. First international race of the year. Yeah, looking forward to it. On the swimming in a 50 meter pool is going to be tough. Then we've got a cycle on Zwift afterwards and then run on a round treadmill which is going to be even more tough but yeah it's going to be exciting what do you reckon myself i think so yeah yeah i'm looking forward to the race of tomorrow we're halfway to rotterdam about right. and we had to stop rachel needed to go to the toilets and we needed some food because we're going to run as soon as we get there so we're still doing three training sessions today, swim, bike and run, and we're driving, well, Marcel's driving there, we're not driving there. Maybe I'll drive now. Maybe Rachel will drive, but 
Oh, really? Let's see, I, I'm not driving. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Cheese bread roll. Hair's looking good. <laughs> I think everyone's gonna think that it only rains in Rotterdam. But I promise you the weather's been good for the last three months, at least. Eight fifty for a cheesecake. Sixty. Three. Here's a hotel room. Pretty sweet. It's not a suite though, because the other one was other room. Somebody else was already in there, and there was like food and stuff, which is nice to have food when you go into your hotel room. But if the beds aren't made and there's no food, it's not the best. So hopefully we can get that suite. Let's have a look. So we made it to Rotterdam, safe and sound. Rachel's dad driving all the way and uh, going for a little 30 minute jog now. And we're watching the juniors and them busy destroying themselves down at the venue. And we're gonna go and check the venue out uh, this evening as well, just to check how the bikes are and the treadmills are. And <laughs> everything is situated, so we shall see. <laughs> that was a bit wild, but okay, uh, yeah. Just wondering if anyone knows why with the Canon M50, why when you press the record button, it kind of crops the outside of the video. I have no idea. Hmm? Trimless material. Gonna be a sweat fest. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fresh new Super League tri suit. The logos are in my like black though, but I do like the green. Nothing you can do about it, but it doesn't fit. Oh. That one's quite easy. I always feel like the Hulk when I put this thing on. No, it's so fair. Ik moet misschien met onder broek af, this isn't the best with my underwear roll. Tight around the neck. Mm -hmm. Intense full body, yes. Yes, that's clean. The room is clean. For a little run. Going down. Hey. Come back. Let's try to see if there was any difference between what my Um, 30 second strides building to race pace and number two let's go So 
we're gonna check we're gonna check the course out but it feels weird walking through a building with my bicycle and it's hot in here holy moly in here yep yep open say open open says me here we are So it's 10 p.m. Uh, evening of the race and uh, yeah, we did the familiarization of the bike and the run and uh, yeah, it was pretty tough, it's pretty late and I'm pretty tired and tomorrow is race day. Enjoy this race and this footage and uh, yeah, if you guys enjoy please subscribe and yeah, hope you guys enjoy this race. So it's race morning, I just woke up, it looks like it's 6 o'clock. But it's not six o'clock. It's like almost nine o'clock. How does it go? <laughs> swim bike run. Swim bike run. So I copied Rachel here. The first one is swim bike run. The second one is bike run swim, and the last one is run swim bike. Sounds quite simple, but sometimes you have to write it on your hand. So I copied Rachel, and this was the second take because the am first. We're elite. And we're elite. <laughs> and the first take. I got this completely wrong and I said run, swim, bike, so there we go, I gotta ride the second go. Just follow other people, make sure you don't screw it up. <laughs> Race day has begun, had some breakfast, climbed on the scale. I was the lightest I've been in ages, 69.4 kilos, Rachel was like just over 50 kilos. So we we're well on our way to a good Zwift weight, which is great. And yeah, looking forward to it. The weather is horrible outside, as you can probably see. Matter. Kind of killed it there, but... <laughs> Uh, yeah, so the weather outside is not great, but it doesn't matter because we're racing inside. Big ups. And uh, what do you reckon, Rachel? What do you what do you have to say? How do you Can feel? We just spent the whole day here, like looking at the nice view. And no, I'm keen to race again. It's been a while. Um, I'm not always keen to race. I get quite nervous normally, but I'm excited. Yeah, not sure if this is my thing, the indoor racing. Well, I'm. I honestly don't think it is, but I'm still excited, and uh, it's good to be back racing again. You look quite composed. Yeah. Good so Well, it's because you got a nice view here as well because Super League hooked us up. Check out the view here, guys. We've got like 180 degree view from the bedroom. Pretty good swim and uh, I was about five seconds behind the leaders with a 213 swim uh, for the 200 and uh, yeah chasing pretty hard uh, heavy and I got a distance for some reason and we we're trying to catch on the bunch here Yes, 
So Avi Gomez, Richard Murray plays eight and nine. Less than two minutes to go for the start of stage two. Three, two, one, and it's a go, 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 go! Let the games begin for stage two. So we're coming into the sprint finish here. Uh, there's a big bunch of us, we're all together. I'm giving it my all, my legs are burning so much. I'm just trying to get across the finishing line, going as hard, about 700 watts. And yeah, I kind of finish off just here, uh, going completely max. I think I came about fourth or fifth in the sprint, uh, ending up uh, eighth overall. Uh, not my best performance, but uh, yeah, I was really, really hurting and oh, finishing up on Zwift is, is really tough. Oh, that was brutal. <laughs> yeah, I did the best one I could today and uh, yeah, kind of happy in one regard, another regard, a bit sad, but uh, yeah, show must go on and uh, whew, on to the next race. Thanks for watching, guys. So that was it. it <clears throat> the arena games my lungs are done from racing so we're driving back from the race Rachel Klammer managed to get second place which is pretty cool how do you feel about the race um, <laughs> it was really good to be back racing again um, it just feels really weird now for some reason not feeling overly excited which might sound weird um, I think I just have to get used to the feeling again of racing it. It was good to compete against others again and yeah, not fight against yourself like you do in training but finally yeah, make it into a real race. So it was good. It was better than I expected. So happy with it. That is good. My race on the other hand was not as fruitful as Rachel's. Um, but yeah, it was quite a, it was a rude awakening. I kind of knew on the swim I would struggle a little bit. Um, and yeah, kind of that was the case uh, with Swift as well. I was a little bit behind coming out the water on the first round. So the first round I ended up cycling with Javi Gomez uh, on the bike kind of further back and we ran for kind of a minor placing. And uh, yeah, overall I ended up coming eighth. And yeah, it wasn't the greatest result from me, but uh, yeah, I learned things from it and I can uh, take that forward uh, to the next races uh, coming up in the next few weeks. <laughs>